Hi, I want to show you how you can make your character slide in Godot. When he reaches the slope, the animation changes to slide. This cool feature is a very old mechanic, especially in platformer games. We flip the animation based on the angle of our slope. But let's start with the basics. Those slopes are exactly 45 degrees. And in my game, they're treated as walls. Because here in the player scene, I've changed the max angle to 43 degrees, so everything that's above it is treated like a wall. And that makes our slopes of 45 degrees also walls. And yes, everything below this number would be considered a floor. And that would mean that our character is able to run up those slopes. Let's get to the script, because here we need a way to detect when our character is on the slope. Here's the if statement, is on wall only, and also the velocity.y is greater than zero. More about detection system here in this video. We are in the function get animation. So here is the logic where I change the animation of my character. And when this if is true, then I change the animation to slide. And when I click on animated sprite 2D, you'll see slide animation, which to be precise is not exactly the animation because it's only one frame, but still it looks like our character is sliding. I've created the variable because it's a bit tricky to match your character sprite with the slope. And that's why I'm slightly changing its offset. So here, vector two, three and three if get real velocity dot x is less than zero, else this vector changes. And here below, I get the reference to my animated sprite 2D that offset equals rotation underscore offset, which is this variable. And this if statement is here because my character gets flip underscore h based on the slope's direction. So when our character is sliding to the left, I need a different offset for my character to match the slide. And you can do the same. Or maybe your assets are perfectly aligned. Then congratulations. But if not, then you can use the same logic as here to make it look better. And at the end, animated sprite 2D, which is a reference, dot animation equals animation slide. And that's the whole idea about sliding. It's a very easy concept, but it can make your game better. Also, there's a tip if you're struggling with the speed of your slide, like I did, then you simply have to limit it just by doing this if statement. So if your velocity.y will be greater than some number, you just make your velocity.y this exact number. And that statement prevents your character from increasing its velocity.y. So when your character reaches the max speed of his slide, it it stays this way. Okay, that would be it for this video. Hope that you learned something new today and that will make your game better. Thank you for your time. Consider leaving a like and subscribe or even a comment. Have a wonderful day. Bye for now.